And now, your Storm Team 18 forecast. Weather from where you live. All right, normally this time of year, like late March, you know, less than two weeks from April, when you get a strong southwest wind or a south wind, we warm up. I mean, we'll have a 70 degree day when we have especially a few days of wind out of the southwest. But you notice today and you'll notice tomorrow and Wednesday, this very strong southerly flow is not overly warm. And there's a reason behind that. One thing is that we had widespread record cold, the coldest it had been since late January, early February in the southeast US this morning, 26 Eglin Air Force Base down here in Florida. We got dropped to 14 parts of Tennessee. The red buds wiped out a lot of trees that were green wiped out uh, some places 90% peach crop loss here in Georgia. So that record cold air is over the Gulf of Mexico. And you can see when you put cold air over warm water, you get clouds and these are the low clouds with that colder air. Now it's moderating that what's happening now is the wind is from the south and southwest. So we are recycling that cooler air back northward. So it's not like we're jumping to 68, 70 degrees immediately. It's going to take some time to warm up ahead of our storm system uh, to really feel like spring for a change, though tomorrow's not terrible. It'll be a windy day, strong flow from the southwest, gusts 30 to 40, of course, and a 51 degree high after 32 in the morning. And there are the highest 49 to 54 area wide. Now, Wednesday's another windy day, gusts 30 to 40. After some rainfall tomorrow night, we'll have some periodic showers and some drizzle here and there on Wednesday with a 55 late day rally, but still strong southerly winds coming in. And there are your highs, low 50s to mid 50s over much of the area. The exception is way down south of Covington, Petersburg at 58. This is all Virga. This will not reach the ground tomorrow, uh, but this will reach the ground tomorrow evening. A little wave of rain comes through and then kind of off again on again. Showers, nothing really heavy, but kind of pesky off and on on Wednesday and even right into Wednesday evening. But then as quickly as the warmer air really starts to come in Thursday morning, the cold front comes south. So after highs low to mid 60s on Thursday morning, we cool off during the day as the wind turns the northwest and the north. So temperatures in the 40s by later on in the day and still some rain around some rain on Friday and a cold rain at that. It may mix with or change with some brief wet snow Saturday night, some rain Saturday, perhaps a little wet snow Saturday night and then some more rain early next week. And all this rain is going to add up. This is what ex is expected Tuesday evening to Wednesday night, 10 to a quarter of an inch. But we keep adding up as more rounds of rain come through. And but between tomorrow evening and whatever we get next week, inch and a half to up to four inches of rain from north to south over the area. So rivers on the rise, 65 then falling Thursday, 40s Friday and Saturday, 57 Monday, then a little colder with a little snow early next week.